Hello, everybody, and welcome to another segment of Let's Talk About It on ESPN Jamestown AM 1400. We're translated over on 107.1 FM, and we're streamed online at newsdakota.com. Today, joining us here on Let's Talk About It, we have the lead singer of Sidewalk Prophets, Dave Fry, joining us. And uh, Dave, welcome to our show. Yeah, so excited to be there. You say you guys are ESPN affiliate? We are ESPN affiliate. Yes, sir. Yeah, so we play like the games. and Yeah, we do all that stuff. I dream. I would dream to be a. I wish we were an ESPN affiliated band. You know? Hey, that That's would like be sweet. Living the life. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Sidewalk Profit, sponsored by ESPN. Yeah, I love that already. Uh, cool. Dave, <laughs> you are the lead singer of Sidewalk Profits, uh, 2010 GMA Dove Award winners for new artist, nominated for Group of the Year, Pop Contemporary Album of the Year, and Song of the Year for Live Like That. Uh, let's hear a little bit about Sidewalk Profits, how you guys came together, uh, and and just just how it all came together and how you guys found that success sure you know we started our band uh back in college uh years and years it was actually in 2001 so it's been so long makes me feel old but uh (laughs) but we started back in college and and uh we uh you know kind of kind of recorded songs my buddy ben and i found each other there on the dorm floor and recorded songs and passed them around through a napster which was legal at the time like passing (laughs) passing uh sharing files and stuff and uh became a uh, a hit on the campus of Anderson University in Indiana. And then we, we, we really um, decided to move to Nashville uh, the year after college. So about uh, about uh, 12 years ago, um, we wrote our song, You Love Me Anyway. And we knew, man, when we wrote that song, we're like, man, this is better than the other songs you've been writing. Maybe there's something here. And so we moved to Nashville with that song in our hand and didn't really have a band. Uh, the band we had kind of stayed behind. One guy was becoming a lawyer one was starting a family so mm. we put an ad on craigslist and uh, for a band and we found our, our our bass player has been with us ever since that ad for 12 years and uh and you know we started playing playing church camps and then uh, after a year in nashville we got signed to to word records and uh they've been so 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 near and dear to our hearts it's been like a family and and uh we you know wrote our first song you uh, words i would say uh, was our first single there to radio and, and God has just been blessing us ever since just touring the country like mad. We tour about 200 days a year. Um, and we got, uh, just, we're right in the middle of an, an incredible tour and just hearing people's hearts and, and seeing a lot of hurt people out there, but man, uh, the power of music, especially when you take that music and you tie it to the Lord, uh, it's a powerful eternal kind of thing. And we're just honored to be even a small part of of uh, people's lives, man. It's been it's been a great journey. Well, absolutely. Again, uh, Dave Fry, uh, lead singer for the Sidewalk Prophets, and now uh, you guys will be in Jamestown. We're very excited here in the community of Jamestown uh, for you to to be bringing your uh, something different tour in 3D. This sounds like it's a super unique tour. You know, you hear all these different tours, people traveling from city to city to city, performing their shows, but in 3D, that little bit at the end throws kind of something special in there, right? Yes. You know, we did want it to, to make it something different, uh, no pun intended, but we wanted it to have a little bit of fun. I think, you know, I think back on bands that I loved growing up, Audio Adrenaline, uh, DC Talk, Newsboys, and they had so much fun uh, yeah. with Big House and, and, and uh, Take Me to Your Leader and, and all these great songs. And, and we wanted to have a little bit of fun at our tour. So we have this, uh, you know, we have some video game arcade machines, uh, Donkey Kong and Pac-Man sitting out in the lobby. We have uh, some Back to the Future references, but also uh, that 3D content. You put on those old school, I'm talking old school blue and red glasses, you know, the ones that, that make your eyes cross a little bit. But when, <laughs> when you look at the, the screen behind us, um, it's so awesome. Our, our keyboardist actually did all the video content and it's it's really pretty awesome like we always hear when the when we do the 3d portion people go ooh ah you know <laughs> that's always what you what you hope and it feels like it's a little bit of like a, a disney world show uh in the middle of a in the middle of a, a praise concert and, and i love that part so so yeah we're definitely having fun out on the road and and that 3d is kind of a, a fun fun element to to what we do and, and of course we'll be playing the songs that you know uh that your listeners probably have heard live like that and words I would say and songs like that, but, but we also wanted to have a whole lot of fun uh, as well. 
Yeah, absolutely. And, and I mean, when people go to a concert, they go for the music. They, they go because they know the band. Yeah. And this just adds a whole nother element of it because people will be entertained sure. with your music, but also with that that audio that you got or that video that you guys have there as well. Uh, so, yeah. so Dave, kind of like, uh, I mean, explain this for, for individuals maybe who have not been to one of your shows before. What can they expect on Sunday, October 7th in Jamestown? I think that, uh, you know, you show up, we, our tour, I always say that it has a couple of, of hopes that, that when people leave, we hope they feel like family. Uh, that's, that's kind of the theme of the, the show is just that we're all a part of this great big family. And so many times we think what we're going through, the things we're struggling with, we're, we're alone in it or we're fighting in ourselves or just us and our close friends. But if we, if you come to a sidewalk profit show, you'll start to look around and see that man, there's a lot of people going through the same things and, uh, and we're, but we're all in it together. And so we want people to realize we don't have fans. We have, we have brothers and sisters and, uh, and we're so grateful when the folks show up, uh, we hope to make them feel like a million bucks and feel like a part of this great big, uh, sidewalk profits family, this family of Jesus. And, and, uh, and then the other, the other goal is to kick Satan in the face. Like that's our hope <laughs> is that, that, you know, Satan has been coming at us for so long and, and, and it may be, you know, keeping us down. Uh, but our goal is, is, is for one night just to, just to fight back, you know, and, and just have that because we already know we got the victory in Jesus, but some days you just need to make sure that, that Satan knows it. And so we declare it loudly. And, and, uh, we, like I said, we have some fun, uh, but also, man, we get to those heart moments, those things that people are really struggling with and, and offer people the opportunity to, uh, to kind of find out who they are at their heart's core, kind of wade through all the stuff they put on top of themselves and all the, the lies that they believe, man. And, and we want them to, to, when they leave, we want them to know exactly who they are in Christ and to know that they're a part of this great big family and, uh, and have some, have some fun doing it and sing, sing their hearts out. And, um, I think we accomplished that. So really looking forward to coming to North Dakota. Yeah, definitely. We're, we're looking forward to having you. Jamestown is excited. We've been giving away tickets. It, it has just been so fun already just talking about it. And we hope we can pack the, uh, the Civic Center this Sunday in Jamestown for the Sidewalk Profits. You also have some special guests with you too, right? Yeah, we got some awesome, awesome friends. Uh, our friend Carmen Justice, uh, is, is, this is her first solo tour. And oh, I'm awesome. telling you. She has an incredible voice. Um, you know, her, her drummer and lead guitarist are not that good. I'm just kidding. They're sitting right next to me. It's, it's our drummer and lead guitarist. You got to, re- yeah, they're, yeah. They're, they're, they're coming out with, with Carmen and filling in. I'm just kidding. But no, Carmen, <laughs> Carmen, honestly, is such an incredible talent. And then Von Ray, they're three brothers and a sister from Philadelphia and they surf and uh, you can nice. tell in their music that they surf. And it's just, a, they just, they bring another element of like, sunshine and joy i heard it might be snowy in north dakota so we brought bon ray because there's sunshine uh in in a band and so yeah, yeah. <laughs> so they'll fight the snow through uh through their music but it no it's it's a it's going to be a whole lot of fun yeah sure. we we definitely could use that we could use a little uh a little bon ray here and a little sidewalk profits and a little carbon justice go. for sure uh so that's this yeah. sunday we want people to get their tickets it's at the civic center in jamestown uh dave if anybody want to learn uh, if anybody wants to learn more about sidewalk profits and and just sure. uh, see where you guys are headed next and and what's the latest with you guys what are some ways they can do that yeah the easiest place is just sidewalkprofits.com there's a bunch of you know uh, you can jump to a lot of things from there, our store, our tour page and all that. Uh, so com, but we're also on Facebook, Sawa Profits and Instagram, SW Profits and, and Twitter. I think the same thing. So uh, <laughs> all I know is if you go to com, uh, you, you will have a good time. There's, there's going to be some silly videos on there. So don't hold me to, uh, to who I am in those silly videos, but. That's yeah, mostly yeah. me anyway. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Well, Dave, we appreciate you taking time. Thank you so much for joining us right here on Let's Talk. Thank you. Uh, yeah, we cannot wait to get on up. Just a couple days away. We're, we're so excited to be coming to North.